is risen, risen in glory from above. He conquered sin, he opened heaven, and then he conquered with his love. This is the day the Lord has made. Alleluia, alleluia. This is the day the Lord has made. him with dreadful pain, absolving sin and human weakness. On the third day he rose again. This is the day the Lord has made. Alleluia, alleluia. This is the day the Lord has made.
Good morning, Chris Strauss class. Please join us as we recite the glorious mysteries of the rosary this morning. Let us remember the women who went with oil to visit the tomb and were told to rejoice. Also, let us pray for peace throughout Ukraine. O oh Lord our God, strengthen the innocent people of Ukraine by your power. Bless their deeds, increase their glory by victory over the enemy, strengthen their nation with your almighty hand, save the defenders of this nation, send your angels to strengthen those protecting the peaceful people. Give them everything needed for salvation. Reconcile enmity and establish peace. For in you we, ha we place our trust and send glory to you, Father, Son, and Holy Spirit, now and forever and ever. Amen. In the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. In the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. In the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. I believe in one God, the Father, the Almighty, maker of heaven and earth, of all that is seen and unseen. I believe in one Lord, Jesus Christ, the only Son of God, eternally begotten of the Father, light from light, true God from true God, begotten and not made, one in being with the Father, through him all things were made. For us men and for our salvation, he came down from heaven. By the power of the Holy Spirit, he was born of the Virgin Mary and became man. For our sake, he was crucified under Pontius Pilate. He suffered, died, and was buried. On the third day, he rose again in fulfillment of the scriptures. He ascended into heaven and is seated at the right hand of the Father. He will come again in glory to judge the living and the dead, and his kingdom will have no end. I believe in the Holy Spirit, the Lord, the giver of life, who proceeds from the Father. With the Father and the Son, he is worshipped and glorified. He has spoken through the prophets. I believe in one holy, Catholic, and apostolic church. I acknowledge one baptism for the forgiveness of sins. I look for the resurrection of the dead and the life of the world to come. Amen. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Let us say three Hail Mary for faith, hope, and love. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. The first glorious mystery, the resurrection. I desire a strong faith. Think of Christ's glorious triumph when on the third day after his death, he arose from the tomb and for 40 days appeared to his blessed mother and to his disciples. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. 
Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my, oh my Jesus, Jesus, forgive us our sins. sins. Save, Save us from, from the fire of hell. hell. And take all souls, souls to heaven, and, and help especially those most in need of your mercy. mercy. The second glorious mystery, the Ascension. I desire the virtue of hope. Think of the Ascension of Jesus Christ, 40 days after his glorious resurrection, in the presence of Mary and his disciples. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. 
O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fire of hell. Take all souls to heaven and help especially those most in need of your mercy. The third glorious mystery, the descent of the Holy Spirit. I desire zeal for the glory of God. Think of the descent of the Holy Spirit upon Mary and the apostles under the form of tongues of fire in fulfillment of Christ's promise. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O oh my Jesus, Jesus forgive, forgive us our sins. sins. Save, Save us from, from the fire of hell. hell. Take all souls, souls to, to heaven, heaven and help and especially those most in need of your mercy. The fourth glorious mystery, the Assumption. I desire the grace of a holy death. Think of the glorious assumption of Mary into heaven when she was united with her divine Son. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. 
Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O, o my, my Jesus, Jesus forgive, forgive us our, our sins, sins, save us from the fire of hell. Of hell. Take, Take all souls, souls to heaven, heaven and, and help especially those most in need of your mercy. mercy. The fifth glorious mystery, the coronation of the Blessed Virgin Mary. I desire a greater love for the Blessed Virgin Mary. Think of the glorious crowning of Mary as Queen of Heaven by her divine Son to the great joy of all the saints. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us and lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my, o my Jesus, Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from, from the, fires the fires of hell. hell. Take, take all souls, souls to, heaven to heaven and help especially those most in need of your mercy. Hail, Hail Holy, Holy Queen, Queen, Mother of Mercy, our life, our sweetness, and our hope. To do you cry for banished children of Eve. To you do we send up our sighs, mourning and weeping in this valley of tears. Turn then, O most gracious Advocate, your eyes of mercy toward us. 
And after this our exile, show unto us the blessed fruit of your womb, Jesus. O clement, O loving, O sweet Virgin Mary, pray for us, O Holy Mother of God, that we may be made worthy of the promises of Christ. In the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit, amen. In the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit, amen. In the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit, amen. the Son, the Holy Spirit, now and forever and ever. Amen. Christos was crest is a mert, with smert, you smert podolau, he teams shall hrabah, zhitya darova. Let us pray to the Lord for the peace from on high and for the salvation of our souls. Let us pray to the Lord for peace throughout the world, for the being of God's holy churches, and for the unity of all. Let us pray to the Lord for this holy church, full of entered with faith, reverence, and fear of God. Let us pray to the Lord. For the most holy universal pontiff, Francis, Pope of Rome, for our most blessed, a Patrick, Svetoslav, our most serene metropolitan, Lawrence, the reverend priest who the diaconate in Christ and all the clergy, the people, let us pray to the Lord. Lord for our nation under God, for our government, for the military, let us pray to the Lord. Lord for this city, for every city and country, for the faithful living them, let us pray to the Lord. Lord for favorable weather, for an abundance of the fruits of the earth, and for peaceful times, let us pray to the Lord. Lord for the sufferers and travelers, for the sick and for the suffering, for those that captive, for their salvation, let us pray to the Lord. Lord that we may be delivered from all tribulation, wrath, and misfortune, let us pray to the Lord. Lord Help and save, have mercy and protect us, O God, by your grace. 
who remember in our most holy, the immaculate, most blessed and glorious Lady, the Mother of God, and ever Virgin Mary, together with all the saints, let us command ourselves and one another in our whole lives to Christ our God. For all glory, honor, and worship befit you, Father, Son, and Holy Spirit, now and forever and ever. Shout to the Lord of all the earth, sing out to his name, give glory to his praise. Through the prayers of the Mother of God, O Savior, save us. Say unto God, how awesome are your works. Because of the greatness of your strength, your enemies will flatter you. Through the prayers of the Mother of God, O Savior, save us. Let all the earth worship you and sing to you. Let it sing to your name, O Most High. Through the prayers of the Mother of God, O Savior, save us. Glory be to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit, now and forever and ever. Amen. Only begotten Son and Word of God, you are immortal, and you will for our salvation to be made flesh of the Holy Mother of God and ever Virgin Mary. And without change you became man. You were crucified, O Christ our God, and trampled death by death. You are one of the Holy Trinity, glorified with the Father and the Holy Spirit. Save us. Szczęście, o Mary, Hospoda, wie pomolim się. Zastupy, spasy, pomiluj, ochrony nas, Boże, Twojej oblogodaciu. Gospodę, pomiluj. Pre svetu, pre čestu, pre blagosloveno, slavno, vladičice naše, Bohorodice, i prisna, Diva Mariju, z osima svetime, pomenuši sami sebi od jednodnoho, i vse žitja naše, Hristu, Bohovi, vidajmo. For you are a good and loving God, and we give glory to you, Father, Son, and Holy Spirit, now and forever and ever. Amen. Come, let us sing joyfully to the Lord. Let us acclaim God our Savior. Son of God, risen from the dead, save us and sing to you. Amen. Благословен Отец Святой, который завжди в небе по всем часам, и навеки Wisdom stand the right. Come, let us worship and fall down before Christ, Son of God, risen from the dead. Save us who sing to you. Oh. Uh -huh. 
show you gain the heights through humility, riches through poverty, father and bishop of the nations, intercede with Christ our God for the salvation of our souls. Glory be to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit. God, our holy, and we give glory to you, Father, Son, and Holy Spirit, now and forever and ever. Let us be attentive, peace be with all wisdom, let us be attentive. Save your people, O Lord, and bless your inheritance. Wisdom. A reading from the Acts of the Apostles. Let us be attentive. In those days, as the number of disciples grew, the ones who spoke, spoke Greek complained that their widows were being neglected in the daily distribution of food as compared with the widows of those who spoke Hebrew. The twelve assembled the community of the disciples and said, it is not right for us to neglect the word of God in order to wait on tables. Look around among our own member, brothers, for seven men acknowledged to be deeply spiritual and prudent, and we shall appoint them to this task. This will permit us to concentrate on prayer and the ministry of the word. 
The proposal was unanim unanimously accepted by the community. Following this, they selected Stephen, a man filled with faith in the Holy Spirit, Philip, Prochorus, Nicanor, Timon, Parmenas, and, and uh, Nicholas of Antioch, who had been a servant of Judaism. They presented these men to the apostles, who first prayed over them and then imposed hands on them. The word of God continued to spread, while at the same time, the number of disciples in Jerusalem enormously increased. There were many priests among those who embraced the faith. Let us be attentive. listen to the Holy Gospel. Peace be with all. And with your spirit. A reading from the Holy Gospel according to Saint Mark. Glory be to you, O Lord. Glory be to you. Let us be attentive at that time. Joseph of Arimathea, a right, a distinguished member of the Sanhedrin. He was another who looked forward to the kingdom of God. He was bold enough to seek the audience with Pilate and urgently requested the body of Jesus. Pilate was surprised that Jesus should have died so soon. He summoned the centurion and inquired, whether Jesus was already dead. Pilate released the corpse to Joseph, then having bought a linen shroud. Joseph took him down, wrapped him in the linen, and led him in the tomb, which had been cut off a um, rock. Finally, he rolled a stone across the entrance of the tomb. Meanwhile, Mary Magdalene and Mary, the mother of Joseph, uh, observed where he, was, uh, he had been laid. When the Sabbath was over, Mary Magdalene, Mary, the mother of J James, and Salome brought perfumed oils with which they intended to go and anoint Jesus. Very early, just after sunrise, on the first day of the week, they came to the tomb. They were saying to one another, who will roll back the stone for us from the entrance to the tomb? When they looked, they found that the stone had been rolled back. It was a huge one. On entering the tomb, they saw a young man sitting at the right, dressed in the white robe. 
with this friend them thoroughly, but he reassured them, you need not be amazed, you are looking for Jesus of Nazareth, the one who was crucified, he has been raised up, he is not here, see the place where they laid him, go now and tell his disciples and Peter, he is going ahead of you to Galilee, where you will see him just as he told you. They made their way out and fled from the tomb, uh, bewildered and trembling, and because of their great fear, they said nothing to anyone. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, Amen. Christos was Christ. Christ is risen. Indeed, he is risen. Dear brothers and sisters, as we continue to celebrate the Easter season, this Sunday is um, the third Sunday of Pascha in which we reflect on the Merbarian women, the first to encounter the new of the risen Lord. Uh, also this year, uh, Easter greeting from our bishops of Canada mentioned about their incredible journey from fear to joy and hope. The Merbarian women are the eyewitnesses of Jesus' death and the place of his burial. They are also the witnesses of his resurrection, the first ones. They are the ones who receive the glorious news from the angel who tells them, do not be afraid, you are looking for Jesus of Nazareth, who was crucified, he has been raised. He's not here. Go tell his disciples and Peter that he's going ahead of you to Galilee. There you will see him just as he told you. Then, as we hear the gospel, we conclude the reading gospel of today in a bit a strange manner. The myrrh-bearing women went out and fled from the tube for terror and amazement had seized them. And they said nothing to one another, to, to, to anyone, for they were afraid. Fear had the potential to prevent the myrrh bearing women from fulfilling the task given them by the angel. Fear had the potential to paralyze them, to bind them. Fear brought about in the Murdering women worry, terror, panic, anxiety, and inability to act. Fear could help prevent us from ever learning about the resurrection of our Lord Jesus Christ, instead, leaving Jesus buried in the tomb forever. Yet, somehow, the murdering women were able to overcome their fear. Matthew's gospel tells us so they left. The tomb quickly with fear and great joy and ran to tell his disciples. Suddenly Jesus met them and said greetings, and they came to him, took hold on his feet, and worshipped him. Then Jesus said to them, Do not be afraid. Go and tell my brothers to go to Galilee. There they will see me. The fear of the murdering women had turned to joy and hope. Their newfound courage and strength transformed them into witnesses and messengers of the resurrection, of the Easter joy. Their testimony allowed the good news of the word of God to spread around the world. In the circumstances of the war in Ukraine, dear brothers and sisters, the fear of war once again, like that of the Merberian women, has the potential not only to paralyze the people of Ukraine, but also the entire world. Yet, the people of Ukraine, as we know, have found courage to fight and defend themselves in the midst of the worst hell. They find strength in their faith, and this is important, as they defend the truth. Many martyrs and many saints are defenders of peaceful, peaceful and innocent people of Ukraine. 
One of these defenders is Saint Athanasius the Great, the patron of our church, and today and tomorrow we are celebrating his feast day. Uh, Saint Athanasius became great not only for his theology, but first of all for, for his faith, for his faith in God, the risen Lord Jesus Christ, as he was defending the truth all his life. First of all, he was a zealous defender of the Nicene Creed in polemics with the Arians, as we know, defending the unity of the Father and of the Son and the divinity of Jesus Christ. Even when he remained almost alone among the bishops who uh, professed uh, this faith, this did not shake his faith. The people of Ukraine, as we know, led by the church, have experienced in their own uh, right Christ passion and crucifixion, journeying to the resurrection and the hope of life. In this, uh, I believe the people of Ukraine find strength. Dear brothers and sisters, may God bless people of Ukraine and all of us through the praise of our patron, Saint Athanasius, and uh, all the martyrs <coughs> and saints of Ukrainian land. Amen. Christos was Christ. Christ is risen. Indeed, he is risen. Let us all say with our whole soul and our whole mind, let us say, Almighty Lord God, our fathers, we pray you hear us and have mercy. Have mercy on us. O oh God, in the greatness of your compassion, we pray you hear us and have mercy. Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy. We also pray for the most holy, universal Pontiff Francis, Pope of Rome, for our most blessed Patrick, Svetoslav, our most servant, Metropolitan Lawrence, for those who serve and have served in this holy church, for our spiritual fathers, and for our brothers and sisters in Christ. Oh, So pray for our nation under God, for our government, for the military. Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy. O oh Lord, our God, we also pray to you, strengthen the pious people of Ukraine by your power. Bless their deeds, increase their glory by victory over the enemy. Strengthen the nation with your mighty right hand. Save the defenders of this nation. Send your angels to strengthen those protecting the peaceful people. Give them everything needed for salvation. And we also pray, convert enemies and establish your peace by your wisdom upon all of your people. Hear us, O Lord, and have mercy. Also pray for um, Metropolitan Lawrence and for uh, uh, Bishop Brian for the ministry. Hear us, O Lord, and have mercy. Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy. We also pray for the people here present who wait your great and bountiful mercies, for those who have been kind to us, and for all Orthodox Christians. Lord, Merciful, loving God, we give glory to you, Father, Son, and Holy Spirit, now and forever and ever. Amen. Again and again in peace, let the faithful pray to the Lord. Lord have mercy. Let us pray to the Lord. 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 Let us pray to the
Wisdom, so that always protected by your might, we may give glory to you, Father, Son, and Holy Spirit, now and forever and ever. Amen. His kingdom, the most holy, universal pontiff Francis Popo from our most blessed Patrice Svetoslav, our most serene, Metropolitan Lawrence, all priestly, diaconal, and religious orders, our nation under God, our government, all those engaged in the service and protection of our country, ever to be remembered founders and benefactors of this holy church, and all you Orthodox Christians, always now and forever and ever. Let us complete our prayer to the Lord. For the precious gifts which have been presented, let us pray to the Lord. For this holy church, for all who enter it with faith, reverence, and fear of God, let us pray to the Lord that we may be delivered from all tribulation, wrath, and misfortune. Let us pray to the Lord. Through the mercies of your only begotten Son, with whom you are blessed, together most holy, good, and life-given Spirit, now and forever and ever. <clears throat> Peace be with all. Let us love one another so that we might be of one mind in confessing. The doors, the doors in wisdom, let us be attentive. I believe in one God, the Father, the Almighty, maker of heaven and earth, of all that is seen and unseen. I believe in one Lord, Jesus Christ, the only Son of God, eternally begotten of the Father, light from light, true God from true God, begotten, not made, one in being with the Father, through, through him, him all things were made. For us men and for our salvation he came down from heaven. By the power of the Holy Spirit he was born of the Virgin Mary and became man. For our sake he was crucified under Pontius Pilate. He suffered, died, and was buried. On the third day he rose again in fulfillment of the scriptures. 
He ascended into heaven and is seated at the right hand of the Father. He will come again in glory to judge the living and the dead, and his kingdom will have no end. I believe in the Holy Spirit, the Lord, the giver of life, who proceeds from the Father. With the Father and the Son, he is worshipped and glorified. He has spoken through the prophets. I believe in one holy Catholic and apostolic church. I acknowledge my baptism for the forgiveness of sins. I look for the resurrection of the dead and the life of the world to come. Amen. Let us stand, with, uh, stand well, let us stand with fear. Let us be attentive to offer in peace the holy oblation. The mercy of peace, the sacrifice of praise. The grace of our Lord Jesus Christ, the love of God the Father, and the fellowship of the Holy Spirit be with all of you. And with your let us lift up our hearts. We have them to the Lord. Let us give thanks to the Lord. It is right and just to worship the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit. The truth. Singing, crying, exclaiming, and saying the triumphal hymn. my body which is broken for you for the forgiveness of sins in like manner the cup after the supper saying drink of it all of you this is my blood of the new covenant which is spread out for you and for many for the forgiveness of sins. Тому то ми спинаємо час пасіон запис, що у нас сталося хрест, хліб, триденне воскресіння, на небі став на землі, перворуч сидіння, другий і славний прихід. We offer to you yours of your own in behalf of all and for all. Дякую. Especially for our most holy, the immaculate, most blessed, and glorious Lady, the Mother of God, and ever Virgin Mary.
Among the first, remember, Lord, the most holy, universal Pontiff Francis, Pope of Rome, our most blessed Patrick, Svetlacel, our most revered Metropolitan Lawrence, for the sake of your holy church, has granted and believe in peace, safety, honor, and health for many years, and rightly impart the word of your truth. And remember, O men and O women. Remember, Lord, the city which we live in, this every city and country. Uh, <laughs> Um, district, village, and the faithful who live in them. Remember, Lord, the sick, the travelers, the sick, the suffering, that have got the salvation. Remember, Lord, those who are fruit, um, uh, uh, doing good works for your holy churches, remembering the poor, send down your mercy upon all of us. And grant that when one voice and one heart we may glorify and sing the praises in most honored magnificent name, Father, Son, and Holy Spirit, now and forever and ever. Amen. And may the mercies of our great God and Savior, Jesus Christ, be with all of you. And with your spirit. <speaking in Spanish> Щоб чоловік любить Бог наш, прийнявши його святий над небесний духовний свій жертовник, як приємний запах духовний зі славного божественного благодаті, дар святого духа, помолімся. Щоб визволитися нам від усякої скорби, гніву й нужди, Господеві, помолімся. Заступи, спаси, помилуй, охорони нас, Боже, Твоєю благодаттю. That this whole day may be perfect, holy, peaceful, and sinless, let us ask the Lord. For the angel of peace, a faithful guide, the guardian souls and bodies, let us ask the Lord. For the forgiveness and remission of our sins and offenses, let us ask the Lord. For all the good beneficial for our souls and for peace for the world, let us ask the Lord. That we may spend the rest of our lives in peace and repentance, let us ask the Lord. For the Christian ends your lives, one that paid in a son ashamed and peaceful and for a good defense at the awesome tribunal of Christ, let us ask the Lord. Having asked for unity of the faith and for the fellowship of the Holy Spirit, let us command ourselves and one another and our whole life to Christ our God. Make us worthy, O Master, with confidence, without condemnation, to dare call you the heavenly God, Father, and Son. Kingdom and the glory are yours, Father, Son, and Holy Spirit, now and forever and ever. Amen. Peace be with all. Bow your heads to the Lord. Through the grace. Mercies and loving kindness of your only begotten Son, with whom you are blessed together, most holy, good, and life giving Spirit, now and forever and ever. Amen. God be merciful to me, a sinner. Let us be attentive to holy things for the holy. Holy, holy, Lord Jesus. 
Jesus Christ, to the glory of God the Father. Amen. Receive the glory of Christ, partake of the source of immortality. Praise the Lord from the But like the thief, I confess to you. Remember me, O Lord, when you come into your kingdom. Remember me, O Master, when you come into your kingdom. Remember me, O Holy One, when you come into your kingdom. May the partaking of your holy mysteries, O Lord, be unto me not for judgment or condemnation, but for the healing of soul and body. God, be merciful to me, a sinner. God, cleanse you of my sins and have mercy on me. I have sinned without number. Forgive me, O Lord. Approach with the fear of God, and with faith Christos was Please join us in our communion hymn, number 122, Arise, Rejoice, the English version C. So 122, version C. <clears throat> Thank you. 
us, God greets us. Sing with gladness every nation, every home and all creation. For God's work has come to pass.
21, let us joyfully all sing. Savior, people of God, and bless your inheritance, Christos was Christ. 
Always, now, and forever, and ever, amen, Christ is risen. Receive the divine, holy, immaculate, immortal, heavenly life giving, awesome mysteries of Christ. Let us rightly give thanks to the Lord. Lord Help and save, have mercy, and protect us, O God, by your grace. Having asked that this whole day may be perfect, holy, peaceful, and sinless, let us command ourselves and one another and our whole life to Christ our God. For you are our sanctification. We give glory to you, Father, Son, and Holy Spirit, now and forever and ever. Let us go forth in peace. Let us pray to the Lord. You bless those who bless you, O Lord, and sanctify those who trust in you. Save your people and bless your inheritance. Protect the fullness of your church. Sanctify those who love the beauty of your house and glorify them by your divine power. Do not forsake us who hope in you. Grant peace to your world, to your churches, to the priests, to your nation under God, to our government, to all your people. For all good given and every perfect gift is from above, coming down from you, the Father of lights. And we give glory, thanks, and worship to you, Father, Son, and Holy Spirit, now and forever and ever. Amen. of the Lord be upon you with his grace and love for mankind always now and forever and ever Amen. glory be to your Christ our God our hope glory be to you Our true God, risen from the dead. By his death, he conquered death into those in the tombs, giving life, uh, our true God, through the prayers of his Immaculate Mother, of our Father among the saints, John Chrysostom, Archbishop of Constantinople, of Saint Athanasius, whose fervorous feast we are celebrating today, and of all the saints and martyrs of Ukrainian land, and of all the saints. Well, have mercy and save us for his good and loves mankind. To the most holy universal pontiff, Francis Pope of Rome, to our most blessed Patrick, his baited with Sviatoslav, to the most reverend metropolitan, uh, Lawrence, and to all in the priestly and religious orders, to all of our uh, fathers, uh, mothers, brothers, and sisters, to all of our parishioners, to our parish council, our choir, and uh, live streaming uh, directors, all who are volunteering and uh, who are participating via live streamings, and to all our brothers and sisters, grant, O oh Lord, many happy years of life. Namnoya i blahaya lita Christos was
granted us eternal life. Dear brothers and sisters, Christos was Christ. Christ is risen. Indeed, he is risen. Please have a seat. I have a few announcements today. First of all, I would like to congratulate to all our parishioners. Uh, happy feast day of St. Athanasius. Tomorrow we are celebrating uh, his feast day. And it's very important for us to be his followers. And we know that he was the one who all his life he dedicated in uh, defending, defending and defending our Christian faith. And uh, this is something that uh, we should remember always because who knows how our Christian church would be if not uh, saints like him. And in this time, you know, as Ukrainian Catholics, let us remember that our brothers and sisters, and I believe over that 80 or even 90 percent of our parishioners are having Ukrainian roots, still uh, uh, families, uh, uh, friends, and relatives, wherever, living in Ukraine. And, uh, and uh, our patron, St. Athanasius, is the great example of defending truth. So the same what people in Ukraine are doing right now. Let us remember that they need our prayers, they need our support, moral <coughs> and financial, and uh, uh, solidarity. May God bless all of us through the prayers of St. Athanasius. Um, uh, also, um, as you know, um, we started last Sunday uh, the Park Hill Annual uh, Appeal. Uh, the info uh, you can find in our bulletins. This um, uh, Sunday, the message is about uh, religious education uh, center. I don't think we have, have to introduce and to say many words as the fruits and deeds of this center is uh, spread, especially in big cities. One of them is Regina, and we have seen many, many people who uh, have come um, to increase their faith, to update and just be together, learning something, discovering about uh, our church and our, our faith. And uh, sisters, for example, and other staff and clergy are doing huge, huge job. Um, and uh, as we know, they need our, our support to continue doing uh, this job. Also, um, uh, you're the, I, I believe everyone received already uh, a package with the information, so you can find uh, everything uh, in there. Um, uh, there will be information about our um, uh, internal appeal. So many times we have the annual appeal that the, about the eparchy, but <coughs> what, is, what is overpaid? you know, the, 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 the money is going to our parish. And uh, this year we established our new goal for our internal parish, uh, parish goal, I mean. And this will be um, uh, safety of our parish. Uh, we would like to install um, uh, video cameras. We are already are, are, are going ahead with this. And uh, what will be covered with our internal um, parish goal? Uh, so that it, it, it will go um, into it. If not, we'll be having another, another appeal uh, after um, we finish uh, the Park Hill appeal. Uh, more information we'll get in our bulletins uh, soon. Also, um, uh, some information about UCWSU League Day that will, will happen on Sunday, uh, May 29th. Uh, we know League Day is to be to, to celebrate this year at our parish. Yesterday we had a very fruitful meeting uh, with UCWC. We got, I believe, nine uh, new members. Uh, we uh, got uh, some people who would like to, uh, to become members as well. And I see great energy, and that gives me peace. And uh, it gives me also courage and uh, energy for myself to, to do my ministry. Uh, so I'm very happy with that. And uh, we know that there's is, there is much to celebrate with growing membership and uh, new opportunities. Um, um, we are still thinking about a program, about liturgy. Uh, and we'll be needing some volunteers, volunteers as well. So if you would like to, uh, to help, please contact Josie. Um, also, UCWC will host um, 
a branch and program uh, to be followed uh, after the liturgy and during the liturgy. Uh, this event is open for all parishioners, family and friends to join uh, in celebration. And um, those who are new members as well, those who are, are reaching milestones of membership anniversaries, etc., will be acknowledged and advanced tickets will be available to, uh, for purchase following each Sunday liturgy starting next Sunday and until Wednesday, May 27th. So if anyone would like to donate raffle prices for this event, please bring them um, on Sundays, labeled to the attention of UCWC with your name and telephone numbers. And uh, the second uh, information, uh, UCWC will be acknowledging grade 12 uh, graduates on Sunday, June the 12th. So if your parent of uh, grade uh, 12 graduate this year, please contact uh, um, Claudette Stefanko uh, or um, email Irina uh, Baran. Uh, you will find uh, in our office uh, their telephone numbers and um, email addresses. And um, uh, more information will be, will be followed. We'll, we'll have something in the bulletin uh, soon. Uh, okay, then another, another big announcement is many of you already heard that um, uh, Bishop Brian uh, is, not, is no more our Bishop of Saskatchewan. He's uh, appointed um, a few days ago as a Bishop of Toronto. So our hierarchy now is led by Metropolitan Lawrence uh, from Winnipeg. And I would like to ask you to keep them in your uh, prayers. And this might be a big, a big change for many of us. But we know that uh, God continues to uh, bless us with uh, new ideas. And every change is always something new to, to start. Um, definitely, it's a big change for myself. As you know, Bishop Brian uh, was uh, uh, the one who uh, ordained me. So he visited my family in Ukraine and uh, in, uh, in Italy a few times. Um, you know, he tried to do all possible that my ministry will be easy, easy to do and I will be, how to say, introduced, fully emerged uh, uh, in, uh, in the life of, of Canada and um, uh, uh, was sustained with the help of, of good people of Saskatchewan. So that is great, uh, great for, for me. Um, may God continue his uh, blessing in, in Toronto, and I know that uh, they need a lot of energy, and um, the same we have to pray for, uh, for uh, Arch Archbishop Metropolitan Lawrence. Uh, we'll have more information um, coming hopefully next week, as uh, we're just, just between uh, waiting for, for more information for our faithful to give. Uh, somebody told me, we'll be missing Bishop Yilin on Easter Sunday. <laughs> Easter Sunday, you know, Christos was cross, Christos was cross. <laughs> so I think that was such a blessing having him, um, having him uh, uh, as kind of farewell. Um, so that's such a blessing for us. Uh, I think this is all about information. So now uh, we'll conclude our service with Mirovania, with anointing of holy oil, and uh, Roseanne will be distributing um, uh, bread as well. And may God bless you all. How blessed Sunday. I would like to thank also those who are praying with us via live streaming uh, today. Uh, again, please contact myself or parish uh, office if you uh, know uh, members uh, who are sick. Uh, we have to update our list as during pandemic, man, many, many of people uh, are not present. Somebody got healthy, somebody got sick. So please, uh, <laughs> please up update. And uh, now we have a possibility to visit, um, visit them uh, at their homes. Definitely following a covenant of care. Many people are trained. So we try to do all the best uh, as good Christians at, uh, at good, uh, good people. Christos was grass, for Istanu was grass. Our closing hymn will be number 123, Christ is Risen, Come and Rejoice, 123. Come and rejoice and bless the Lord, for he arose as he had said.
Rejoice, rejoice, for Christ is risen, risen in glory from above. He conquered sin, he opened heaven, and man he conquered with his love. This is the day the Lord has made. Alleluia, alleluia. This is the day the Lord has made. Alleluia, alleluia. The Lord prevails, though human malice afflicted him with dreadful pain. Absolving sin and human weakness, on the third day he rose again. This is the day the Lord has made. Alleluia, alleluia. This is the day the Lord has made. Christos Christ, Christos Christ. 